Hi guys, um, this is my TED talk, it's called Change is Necessary. Much like Kylie Jenner, I feel like this year is really about like, like, the year of just realizing stuff. I realized I've been using semicolons wrong, Japan's diet is a bicameral legislature, not rice and fish, and I will be marrying Trevor Noah. <laughs> I learned that when I tried my hardest to immerse myself in my learning, <laughs> the easier and less strenuous it became to put my nose to the grindstone and push through work. The less I began to care about percentages and the nitpicky requirements school threw at me, the more I became wholeheartedly interested in what I was learning, and from there I could see my grades rise and my academic life flourish. In life, I realized that again, an attitude could change a lot. Coming into freshman year, I recognized it as a fresh start, a new beginning, an opportunity for me to change. But by the beginning of sophomore year, I was disgusted at who I'd become. I had filled my life to the brim with negative energy and people, and constantly found myself doing things to please others, and never took the time to do things for myself. I'd completely lost my way, and to be honest, I had no real sense of me anymore. I felt like someone had put a paper bag over my head and led me around, wherever the crowd went, doing what I was supposed to do. It was as if I had been cast in some low-budget teenage party movie, and I was the girl you were supposed to hate. <laughs> I felt an overwhelming pressure to make the right choice, not to slow My aha moment was when I realized that change is necessary. Necessary for not only becoming happier, but necessary for my growth and, and mindset as a young adult. I began to do things that truly made me happy and began making decisions on my own accord. Yet, the end result wasn't always as rewarding as seeing my GPA rise. Change is scary and apparently not, on to, not only to me, but to the people I surround myself with. In the past few years, I've lost contact with people I once thought as my best friends, and I've also made some amazing bonds. I'm so fortunate to be surrounded by such influential, driven, hardworking friends that push me each and every day to be better and to do better. And if not that, to do something. Learning that change is necessary scared me, because oftentimes change brings mistakes. And in school we are taught that mistakes are bad. You get punished with a 60% in your report card. But if you are making mistakes, you are trying new things. You are living. I am learning, pushing myself, changing myself, changing my world. These past two years I've made glorious <laughs> mistakes, fashion mistakes. And costly mistakes. I have made mistakes that no one has made before. And I refuse to stop and worry that what I'm doing isn't good enough, because the best I can be sounds exactly how it is. I don't fear failure from change. I fear being in the exact same place and mindset next year that I am today. So I want to thank each and every one of you for making this year the year of just, like, realizing stuff. <laughs>